Uh, I hope everything is cool over there. Everything is well, thank you. Great. So you have a concert coming together, which is uh, the two of you, you and Sonny. Uh, yeah. Why did you decide to team up for this virtual concert? Um, I, I, I think it was about time. And I think this season has been the best season to do it. So um, everything has kind of slowed down. So I think just to keep everybody going, it was definitely the best decision that he, that he made. Great. Uh, so what should uh, fans and music lovers expect from the concert and what does it mean to you personally? Um, okay, fans need to expect what the darling boy of Africa usually does. He really put on a show. <laughs> he, he had a blast. So um, I think what, if you go back and look on YouTube, what he's used to doing, that, that's basically what they were going to expect. I think for me personally, it's something that I really needed because um, I haven't been singing for so long. And I, I think I just realized that I've really missed it. I have really missed singing. So I think, um, I think that's it. When was the last time you actually actively performed? Um, I think that was 2014. That's quite a wow. So that's, yeah, that's, it's been a long, long, long time. And well, in terms of uh, music, uh, we've seen performances, videos of you uh, in the past. Uh, but what are you currently, where are you currently at in terms of your own repertoire? And uh, are you working on any projects as well? Yeah, I, I think I've just started. I think for the last five years, I've just been having children. So I've had nothing to do but just to kind of sit that time out and do, do the children thing. And I think now is my time to focus on me and do what I love to do best. Well, it's time for you to do a lot of things. And one of them is this interview you're doing because for a very long time, you have been somebody who has shied away from the uh, media. Why is that so? I am a very, very shy person. And I think social media and stuff like that, I'm just not really into it. I mean, do forgive me. I know that we're in a, a virtual time, but I'm just, I'm just not interested. I think the only thing I have is like a Facebook page. <laughs> but I'm not, I'm not, I, I'm not in, in tune with it. I can do it, but I'm not in tune. It's not a passion for me. And you, you did talk about um, making babies and it's almost six years of marriage uh, to Sunny. What has it been like so far? Um, it has been a, a, a beautiful journey. I think it's been a very interesting journey. Um, I think they always say that marriage is a beautiful thing. It just has to be with the right person. Um, we've, we've, we've gone through the highs, we've gone through the lows, we've gone through the children. And we, we, I think we've, we've had a great six years. It's, 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 been, it's been good. Has there been any one thing that you haven't been able to do because the children came in? Um, I think ministry. <laughs> ministry, the singing, the, the air. I think that's the, that's the biggest thing. So, I mean, four, four children already, uh, how, how does it feel like to be at home with them? What, what's your household like with all these four kids? From, I have only one and already. I, 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 <laughs> 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 okay, so we've got literally like, we've got the eight month old, we've got the two year old, he's just turned two, and then we've got the, the four year old. Then we have a 17 year old and everybody needs their time. Everybody has their own personalities, their own characters. So the house is quite crazy. It, it is quite crazy, but I love, I, I wouldn't change anything. There's nothing about it that I change. You know, sometimes we sit down and we imitate the kids and we have a great laugh out of them, you know? So I think, I, I love it. I, I, I wouldn't change it. I don't think I have any more for now, but <laughs> I think at this point I am satisfied and I'm happy. And, and what kind of a father has Sonny been? Uh, is he the hands-on dad? Uh, oh, he's a great dad. He, my husband is a great father. He, uh, that I can never take it away from him. He is a great father. Um, he's very hands-on with the kids. Um, he's a great father. He, he really is. He's, he's very into the children. He makes time for all of them. And like I said, everybody's at different stages. So they all need different things. And I think adjusting to all of that as well um, has got better for him over the years because obviously 
having two children, then you give two children your time. Having three, then you spread yourself out amongst three children. Now having four, you spread your time out amongst the four children. So he, he's done a great job. And being this coronavirus era, it seems everybody's at home. So perhaps there's even more for him to experience as a dad. What has been the impact of uh, COVID-19 on family life and on ministry as well? Um, I think I've loved, I've loved this season. I am, I'm really enjoying it. I think um, everything has been stripped back. So if you thought that life was about cars, well, you can't drive them now. So where are you going to go? If you thought it was about designer clothes, there's nowhere to wear them to. So I think everything has been stripped back and it's all about good health. It's all about the love that we have for each other. So I think in this season, just looking, I think everything has been redefined and I have enjoyed it. I'm used to being at home anyway. I'm not really, you know, uh, the going out person. So being at home has just worked for me. Um, I think the tempting thing is knowing that you can't go out um, when you really want to. <laughs> so that's a bit difficult. But apart from that, we have enjoyed it. I think in ministry, I think you've, we've just gone back to basics, to how things used to be. You know, it's just you and God. Nothing else matters. And clearly in this season, that, that's the truth. Because if you were thinking that the church was, or God was the building, well, we can't go there anymore. So I think in this season, it's just about redefining everything. And I, 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 I have thoroughly enjoyed it. So mom and dad have a virtual concert coming up very soon. Have any of the kids sort of shown signs of uh, music yet? Every single one of them, apart from the eight month old, and even her, she shouts. She shouts very loud. So I can see that her, 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 her vocal cords are coming, um, they're coming together quite well. So all of them, especially my son. My son is the, he's a carbon copy of the dad. He's into every single instrument and he is, he loves rhythm. He, he, as you see the dad, he's just a miniature version of his father. Fantastic. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, maybe we can wrap up on uh, the day, let people know how to tune in uh, and what to expect. <laughs> um, so I think it's going to be on Facebook, um, Instagram and the various, um, and YouTube. So you can go on and you can log into all of that. And I think you're just going to expect, or you have to expect a great time in the presence of God, you know, get your dancing shoes ready. Um, it, it's going to be a great night. Fantastic. I mean, we, we saw uh, the Corona one that Sony sort of frontlined and we loved it. So we know it's going uh -huh. to be equally amazing. Uh, He's a show boy. He is a show boy. <laughs> so we don't expect anything less than that. Fantastic. I would definitely tune in. Uh, my greetings and love to the family and oh. we keep an eye out for you on the day. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you.